we've come together in this beautiful country club where Dan and Laura can pledge their love in a setting that will never be duplicated in all the world. Dan and Laura, the vows that both of you are about ready to exchange will join your lives together. And you both bring individual strengths and giftiness into this marriage relationship. And as you stand together as a couple, may your love continue to grow and deepen as you do life together under this magnificent covenant called marriage. This is real love. I want to be the one who brings out the color and gray days. Be your shelter. The one you run to in the rain. Just find a light in everything has never been so easy. Do you, Dan? Promise to grow old together with Lord, to shake your fist at teenagers, and to talk endlessly about the good old days when things were better and cheaper, <laughs> and generally more wholesome. Do you, Dan, take Laura to be your wife, the mother of your fur babies, and the and best friends until death do you part? Very good. Do you, Laura? Promise to be true to Dan, to uplift and support him, to frustrate and challenge him. And if the stars align just right, would you let him win an argument? <laughs> Do you, Laura, take Dan to be your husband, the father of your fur animals, and best friends until death do us part? The very good. The vows that you, that you have exchanged join your lives together. And today, both of you will be exchanging rings to wear as visible, tangible symbols of the spiritual and emotional connection. These rings will announce to the entire world that you are now committed to the one that you truly love. Dan is a symbol of your love to the one you now place her ring on her finger. And as you do, repeat this after me. Laura, with this ring, Laura, with this ring I, give you my heart. I give you my heart. I promise from this day forward Mistake, you shall never walk alone. You should never walk alone. May my heart be your shelter. May my heart be your shelter. And my arms be your home. Mm -hmm. Very good. Mm -hmm. Well, as a symbol of your love to Dan, we now place his ring on his finger. And as you do, repeat this after me. Dan, with this ring, Dan, with this ring I give you my heart. I give you my heart. I promise from this day forward. I promise from this day forward. <laughs> you shall never walk alone. May my heart be your shelter. May my heart be your shelter. And my arms be your home. And my arms be your home. Home. Very good. So by virtue of the authority vested in me in conformity with the laws of the state of Florida, in the presence of God, your family and friends, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Dan, you may now finally, officially, and with great joy and passion kiss your bride. <laughs> Now, before we go, I want you to step around this way. Because, don't oh, come around this way. Before I introduce you as a married couple. Come around this way. Now, before you do that, this is the breaking of the glass. And today we conclude the ceremony with a Jewish tradition of the breaking of the glass. There's many meanings to this, but the meaning that I like to take away from this is to be fruitful. A hope that your happiness will be as plentiful as the shards of glass that are being able to be broken. And I know afterwards you got a friend in Oregon that's going to yep. put that together in a nice art form. So, um, both of you are going to do this together. So, now before we do this, Dan, before you break the glass, both of you, I'm going to quote a good rabbi friend. And this is what he said to in his ceremony. This is the last time that you'll be able to put your foot down. <laughs> so I want you to do this very deliberately and get all the frustration out right now. So, and when we do that, we need to say mazel tov, right? So one, two, three, ma. Yay! Go ahead and meet in the front. Music. We're ready. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together. Amen. Dan and Laura going down the aisle.
united in marriage. abundance of support and guidance, plenty of fur babies, and may tonight be the first of many amazing memories as husband and wife. And you'll be forever mine. I'll be right here next to you. As long So close, even though we almost killed each other a couple of times, more than once. But we also looked out for you, and I could not pick a better mate for him, a better life mate, and someone who compliments him as much as the Lord does. And the amazing warmth that I have experienced over this week from everyone I have encountered has just blown me away and I will keep that in my heart forever. And I will always remember this. And I will remember this as a time that I have gotten really close to the world. Because as much as I have known her, this is the, I think this is the longest we've spent together. And it's, it's magical. And you know what? You guys are going to have an amazing life. Somehow these guys needed to find each other in this space-time dimension that we call life. And they did find each other, fall in love, and bring us to this wonderful day here to celebrate today. So thank you, Lord. As you go through life, always look after each other. Be there for each other. We all need that love and emotional support. Uh, and it even gets more important as time goes on. Good luck and God bless you.